Uh, hello. Um, I have managed to live an extraordinarily lucky lifetime. Um, one of my first strokes of luck was happening to arrive at UC Berkeley the same year that uh, Unix did, 1973. And so I got in on the ground floor there. And there were some extraordinary people at Berkeley as well, which made Berkeley Unix into uh, something that was closely tied to the growth of the internet. When I started, of course, there was no capital I internet. Um, there were, however, uh, eventually a bunch of smaller networks that didn't talk to each other. And I decided that they needed to talk to each other, at least for email. And we had ARPANET, we had something called BERCnet, we had UUCP, and later Purdue Net and CSNet, and so forth. And so that was the lowercase i internet. That's what uh, John Quarterman calls the matrix. And that was deliver mail. That was to make those things work together. Uh, Bill Joy was uh, one of the principals on the Berkeley Unix version that had the first TCP stack, IP stack. And he needed somebody to write the mail server. And uh, somehow he convinced me to do this, which uh, if I had realized at the time, I never would have done it. But that's true of many things. Um, so that was the uh, conversion from deliver mail to send mail. The goal of send mail was still to try and unify things, pull things together, and not necessarily to do everything, um, which many systems these days apparently feel they need to re-implement absolutely everything, which seems wasteful to me. Uh, I also ended up working on something called syslog, which is the basic system logging facility. I did that as part of the SendMail project, but intentionally to be generic. And that, in some sense, has been more successful than SendMail, even though nobody seems to know that I wrote it. Uh, it's in pretty much every printer, wireless access point, you name it, it's, it's just there. And uh, so I'm actually quite proud of that, even if I am anonymous on that side. Um, there are, of course, way too many people to thank, so I'm not going to try and thank all of them, but I'm going to call out just a couple of names. Um, Bill Joy, of course, who, if he hadn't talked me into this, it, I wouldn't be here today. Um, Michael Stonebreaker and Susan Graham, who uh, were both at various times employing me to do something else, and yet still managed to allow me to work on SendMail. Um, Brian Costales, who literally wrote the book on SendMail and uh, made it much more popular. Documentation is important, I'm here to tell you. And finally, my husband, Marshall Kirk McCusick, who uh, supported me through a lot of this thing, including all the times I spent way more time with my computer than I did with him. Thank you. <laughs>